Welcome back to Let's Play Tomb Raider Rider 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 I'm gonna have a real hard time saying the name of this game over and over again. Is there anything down here? Um Yes there is, in fact. Let's go up and not drown. I really don't like swimming in games. I don't I kinda of don't like water in general. In real life, even. It's 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 kind of it, it triggers some. I think it has something to do with claustrophobia. It, it's sort of related to. I do know how I have a slight sense of claustrophobia. Uh, I know this because I've been in a very tiny, tiny, and very deep cave in real life when I was a little bit younger. Oh, and that actually got me to freak out a lot more than I thought it would. And that's when I learned that. Oh, yeah, look at that. My suspected claustrophobia is actual claustrophobia. I now have proof of it. I did not like that cave. And the idea of being underwater, you know, it's not exactly an uncommon fear. So I don't really have to justify it or explain it, I don't think. Ooh. Um, is it safer if I go around? I don't want to fall down from here. Yeah, this feels better. Can I jump back up? Oh, no, I cannot. Oh, crap. Ah, uh, easy there. Look at you. All texture blending and stuff. Whoop. You dry now? Uh, was that even water that I saw, or was it some kind of weird? Dude, I have no idea. I'm not gonna spend. I'm not gonna spend this the whole game looking at her. Except this. <laughs> that's exactly what I'm gonna spend the whole game doing, because it's a third-person game. Ah, uh, um. I think I'm going that way. So yeah, swimming. Uh, under, underground swimming sections. Underwater swimming? You know what I mean. The kind of thing where, hey, the challenge in this part of the game is that you have to navigate this section quickly or else you're gonna drown. I don't like those. They don't freak me out, like, emotionally. I just don't... I don't know. I don't enjoy the way they play, and also, if I try to make myself immersed in the game, then that would probably freak me out. No, nope, wasn't close enough to the, to the edge. Here we go. Um, do I want to jump back from here? Is that what I'm doing? Yes, good. Fortunate. Ah, uh, just, 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 uh, yeah. Oh. Ooh, do I want to go back there? Is that what I'm doing? Yes, it is. Yeah, I do, I do enjoy games like this. Games that are primarily about traversal and they they can get old. And in some cases they aren't that fun, but it's just I like exploring. I really really like exploring. It's like half the reason I play things like 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 uh, like Minecraft is because hey, here's a randomly generated world. Explore. Yes, yes please. If if you say so, that's exactly what I'm going to do. I can't get up there, can I? Oh, we cannot get up there. What am I doing over here, then? Are you sure I can't get up there? I don't think I can get up there. If I can get up there, someone's gonna be pissed that I didn't figure out that I can get up there. It totally looks like I'm supposed to... Aha! Uh -huh. Go that way. And drop. And up. And, um... I guess that way. Whew. Yep, oh, nope, nope, you have to press back. Ah, there's things down there. I don't know what that was. Some, some, something moved. Was it a dinosaur? Or was it like a butterfly? I can't tell the difference between a dinosaur and a butterfly. Here we go. And up. And up. Was that too late? No, that was not too late. Huh, getting the hang of all this. Alright. Please. All right, cool. Is there anything else? I don't think so. Look at this place. How did they pull this area off in the first game? Because I know, you know, the whole T-Rex part. There was at least a T-Rex in the first game. I know that much. Because um, that that was kind of a famous scene, or a famous section. 
Because here's a friggin' T-Rex in our game. It didn't really look like a T-Rex that, but you know. Dark, mysterious cave. I like those in video games too. Huh? Is this... Yeah, okay. Ah! I did not want to fall there. She super mega died. Because I wasn't ready for the slope, so I didn't do that in time. Ha! Huh, ha! Huh, nope, nope, that's not it either. I wouldn't, shouldn't have dropped there. Risky thing about games that, no, oh god, I pressed the jump button, I swear I did. Is there an achievement for dying a thousand times? Because I'm on my way there. Here we go. Yeah, sometimes there's, it's just sort of... If, if I was her, I would have been able to drop there and grab that. But she actually can't, because the game isn't made that way. And some of these games sometimes are really bad at conveying what you actually can or can't do. I think I'm supposed to jump backwards here. Yeah, how was I supposed to figure that out? I couldn't even see that. I couldn't even see that from there. Am I supposed to go there? Or there? I... Hmm. Uh, well, let, let's let's go this way. Yeah, I know. Sorry, slow climb. That's not okay. Yes, sure. Jump. Okay. No, no, not that way. Their way. <laughs> Their way. Yes. Um. What could be over there, if anything? Wait a minute. Have I been over there? Oh, I'm in here again. I see. That makes so much sense. I can't even begin to describe how much sense that makes. I trust there's something I can grab onto on the other side there. Yes, there is. Ugh. Almost didn't, though. Indeed. Right, cool. I didn't expect it to actually take me back this sort of the, the long way. Although, well, I did, because I remember looking at this and going, well, that's clearly the way you're supposed to go to get out of there. Um, I can't do that, can I? Oh god, I think I can. Yes, I can. Neat! Here's this, that I tried to jump up on before and couldn't. Because I'm stupid. And I think you can probably drop down there and slide down, but I'm not going to risk the fall damage. Maybe that's just there, there's a failsafe if you slip and... Yeah. This is where the stupid bear was. That's right. This is fun. This game is fun. At least so far. I haven't exactly gone any, anywhere yet, but so far it's fun. There's the whole... Oh god, okay. No. <sighs> Well, now I have to get back up there. I guess that's this. Whoa! Um, no, that's not how you do that. Wait, whoop! For a second there, I forgot I'm not playing uh, Assassin's Creed. I was like, well, if I just press the button forward, she's gonna run up that thing and balance on her own. That's not how this works. Oh god, that's not how this works either. <laughs> the ragdoll when she falls to her death is hilarious. I'm not supposed to think that, but it's totally hilarious. <laughs> it looks really funny. Every single time. I've seen it quite a few few times so far. You haven't, but you'll... <sighs> you'll get there. You'll have to trust me on that. Oh, crap! You see that she sort of bounces and goes limp. It's <laughs> it doesn't look as gruesome as someone falling to their death is supposed to look. It looks really funny. It's like she turns into a rubber doll and boing! Ah, uh, good that I'm finding myself amused by that, because we're gonna see it a lot more. Surely I can make this jump. There it is. I think there's something down there, though. And that's where the first cog was, isn't it? And those ledges is probably how I'm supposed to get down as soon as I do what I'm supposed to do here. Um, or should I do that now? I know, thank you. Oh, does, does, it, does it want me to actually practice that? Where am I supposed to be? Am I supposed to go here first? Or is this like a way out? And, or, or is it optional that I go back and place the cog? It almost looks like it. Where, where would the cog lead me, though? 
This looks like something that, that can be lowered down to make the water level in the following section rise, so maybe it's that's what I'm supposed to do. I just I don't I don't I don't I Let's go this way. Everything just sort of breaks in this place. Except for the things that that need to be functioning in order to like, you know, the magical doors. Those never break when they're supposed to open. They don't just go clunk. Oh, something broke off in there. You can't get through now. I really don't feel like I'm going the right way. I, I want to go back in there and do the cog thing. What, what, why is there a switch up there? How do I get there? Do, uh, ah! Ah! <laughs> I don't... I, 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 um, but the cog... I'm, I'm going back. Screw him. I'm, I'm going back, you guys. <laughs> so there. Do I have to do this or can I... I don't, I don't want to... That doesn't look pleasant. I don't want to fall in. I don't know if she really cares, but that would be a very unhealthy thing in real life. That's pretty... Pretty rapid... Uh, rapid there. Is this a safe place to dive from? I have water, so let's... Let's do what the game tells us to and hold B. <laughs> she screams because she didn't like that. Uh, okay. I saw like a cave down there. I think there's something here. Have I been here before? No, I haven't. Aha! It's a thing! How exciting! That's a med kit. That's not too exciting. I'm definitely hearing sparkles, and it's not the thing that was doing the sparkles, because I already picked up the thing. Now I'm not hearing sparkles anymore. Okay, game, are you trying to tell me something with those sound effects, or...? God, I hate it when people end sentences in or... dot dot dot, and I just did it myself. Ah, I'm so annoyed with myself, why would I do that? Because even if you don't add an or at the end of a sentence like that, it's implied. It, it's sort of implied that if 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 X isn't true, then you know, are you implying something with that, or aren't you? And if the next sentence is or aren't you, then you could just say or aren't you, because there's only one option in that case. Because it's a binary thing; either it does or it doesn't. So the or is just ah, why is this annoying me so much? <laughs> Why don't you give me a phone? Okay. A phone? Uh, whatever. Cog! Yes, give me a phone, please. Could use a new phone. But I don't want a stupid smartphone or anything. It's a stupid smartphone. Okay, that turns the thing up there. I did the right thing coming back here, I think. Yeah, I could use a new phone. I have a thing against smartphones, though. I don't want a phone that's also a like, computer, because I have a computer. If I can use my computer, I'm using my computer. In-betweens don't do me any good. Wireless internet could be useful, but... But it also opens you up to so much stuff that... You actually kind of... Oh, whoa! Don't... Ah! Oh, she made it. Oh god, there's another cog here. Ah, crap. I don't think I did the right thing in coming back here, you guys. I think the third cog is up the river. <sighs> oh well. Yeah, a smartphone opens you up to a lot of annoying things. God, what? Well, how do... Alright. Those lights just kind of make me think that there's a way to climb up there without having to go the whole way around. Is that true, Mr. Game? I think it's true. Thank you, Game. You are very well designed. Hey. Um, 
I don't seem to be able to pick those up. Am I full up on whatever that is? What is that? It's shotgun, isn't it? I have 32 shotgun ammo. Yeah, it's not letting me pick that up. That sucks. I don't even have a shotgun. I'm already full on ammo. I think at least. Oh, I didn't have to climb around at all. I could have just gone up. Up the Alright, I'm getting that cog. Well, y yeah, of course I am, but I'm thinking, should I do it before ending the video? Oh, checkpoint again, thank you. Uh, no, I don't think, I don't know how f much further the cog actually is, but the least thing I, the least I can do... Now, the least I can do is say, see you next time on Let's Play Tomb Raider, Tomb Raider Anniversary. I'll see you back on that ledge over there. Until next time.